As a homegrown hobby group that started in 2005, the Verts turned pro and incorporated an online enterprise seven years later. Their videos have clocked upwards of 7 million views. To date, their YouTube channel has over 52,000 subscribers from 180 countries. And they are a homegrown success in every sense of the word. But the cut then rolls down the fingers and transitions into a position where I can shoot the cut into the other hand. It's a one-handed flicker shot. So, let's get started. Okay. Really. I'm the leader of the Verts. I lead the team, I manage the team. I do a lot of the writing, the tutorials. And I'm the photographer for the Verts. And I also do the video stuff. I never knew that cut flourishing would one day become a business where we could create tutorials and we could sell decks of cuts. I'm a cut flourisher and I do video editing for the Verts. It needs to be done so that I could put videos out there online. I come up with my own material to perform for the Verts. So like, you know, a few moves that we have are by me. Also, I manage the customer relations aspect. I'm the graphic designer. That entails designing the deck and our marketing materials. I'm actually the only member of the group that doesn't exactly flourish. In mainstream Singapore, it is not easy for niche subcultures to take root, let alone reach across the globe. But the internet has dramatically changed the paradigm. This is a red carpet that celebrates the power of media in this internet age. Celebrity video creators from Singapore and abroad are attending YouTube's annual FanFest. Many begin as amateurs from their homes, but are now riding the crest of this new game-changing medium. One of the FanFest's key events is the Creator Academy. YouTube channel creators are given training by industry experts on how to increase their digital viewerships even further. As one of the top video creators in Singapore, the Verts have also been invited to the Academy. YouTube creators who have invested in building a community, who have built fan bases, they have gone from being just creators to entrepreneurs, to businesses, and that's creating tremendous opportunities for them. We have a billion people coming to the site every month, and those people have lots of varied interests. This is a great platform for those types of niche subject matters, and there's no geographic boundaries. 